laying off 40 people after a multi-million dollar loss. ABC 17's Kennedy Miller is live in studio tonight. And Kennedy, the company did not say, though, if the layoffs would affect the company's Columbia plant. Lucas, the company reported its second largest quarter ever in terms of sales in quarter 222, but still posted a loss of money. Employees for the operation team in multiple locations at Beyond Meat are being hit hard after the food manufacturer out, uh, out at nearly 40 positions. Here's why. According to a Beyond Meat press release, in 2022, net revenues was sitting at $147 million, which is a decrease of 1.6% year over year. The department reports a gross profit loss of $6.2 million so far in 2022, and the team reports a net loss of $97.1 million this quarter. Beyond Meat has been up and running since 2009, and it produces plant-based meat substitutes. The company has a plant in North Columbia and expanded it back in to, uh, 2018. Reports state the layoffs are a result of the company struggling to turn partnership into a profitable endeavor with some of the biggest restaurant companies like McDonald's and Yum Brands. The company's effort to increase production and create new products have also been ruined by setbacks, including escalated competition. And as the company announces new products, it's still figuring out the best way to make them, which is getting pricey. Beyond Meat President and CEO Ethan Brown increased manufacturing costs, including de depreciation, increased material costs, higher transportation and warehouse costs, and an increase in inventory are some reasons for the drop in revenue. And the press release also states the business is focusing on manufacturing cost reductions and strengthening its retail business. Those layoffs should have the company about $8 million. Back to you, Lucas.